Hey, how's it going? We're playing some more Sly 4. Let's go ahead and grab Sly. He has the next mission. Last episode or this episode or whatever. We're going to go ahead and get the rest. Of, well, we got the rest of the bottles and we got the last safe, as you can see. Um, so I might be playing that footage now. Um, the footage might have been last episode. Who knows? This is all before editing. Um, but yes, we got a Sly mission. Let's go ahead and head over there. But we are all done. For this entire series, Woo! for this entire series, we don't have to look for another bottle or safe. Now all we got is treasures and collectibles, which a lot of those deal with using special powers from the special Sly Coopers. So those we're gonna get probably once we wrap up the story. Okay. Apparently, Salim lost a small fortune betting on the camels a while back and had to pawn his thief outfit. Sly, if we could buy that outfit back for Salim, I'm sure we could gain his trust. The shopkeeper is a security freak, a real head case. His place is a fortress and he never leaves. All business is conducted through a slot in the door. I think this is one time we're going to have to play it straight and pay the man what he wants. As you might imagine, his price is pretty steep. The shopkeeper will only accept payment in the form of flawless gemstones. Three to be exact. The only gems of that quality around here are the decorative stones embedded in the city walls. I've located the three largest... We were looking at those story. earlier. All you have to do is remove them, avoid the guards, and bring them to the shop. Just make sure those gems are still flawless when you get there. Honestly, that seems like... We're overpaying by a lot. Those gemstones are worth millions of dollars. You're telling me for some clothes, we're paying millions of dollars? Like, what is this? Like, supreme thief clothing? Makes no sense to me, but here we go. Zoink. Gimme, gimme. Yeah, okay, never mind. Millions? Probably billions, bro. Look at that stone. That stone is way too sick. But what is? My other comment was, Bentley said, for this one, I think we'll have to pay him up. Well, you have to pay him up. According to the gang's, um, how they operate, we only steal from thieves. That guy runs a business. He's not a thief. Therefore, even if we could steal it from him, it wouldn't be. We couldn't steal it from him. That's not how our gang operates. So... Just putting that out there. We couldn't steal it from them, even if we wanted to. Unless we want to become the bad guys. I think that's, like, a lot of them villains in this story are like, Well, you guys are thieves. Yeah, but our whole deal is we only steal from other thieves. But if we did steal from that guy, we would be the bad guys. So, just putting that out there. Still think we're massively overpaying for this, though. Honestly, why don't we just get them, like, a... Like a camel voucher. One free camel. Get him a camel voucher. Why do we why do we need to get him gemstones? If anything. Oop, I'm falling in the water. Why don't we just like take these gemstones, bring them to modern day. Now they're ancient gemstones. Sell them for a couple billion dollars, bring that money back, and then just pay him a whole bunch. Alright, where's this last gemstone? Yeet. Am I sounding like Penelope here? <laughs> Or what was no the Grizz? Let's just bring stuff back into modern day so they're worth more. What up, homie? Don't mind me. Oh, how in the world? Oh, I have to get on this thing, don't I? Boing. Gimme, gimme. Wasn't there like a treasure thing up here that we didn't get? <laughs> thank you, thank you. Gimme, gimme. Okay, Bentley. No, I'm just gonna jump off a bridge for fun. I wonder if they're ever gonna give us a rocket boots. Those things were so cool in the other games. Here you go. Here's a couple billion dollars in gems. Just give me a piece of clothing back. What do you want? I'm here to buy the thief outfit. Sorry, I do not believe one such as yourself could meet my price. Good day. Didn't even look. That's too bad. <sighs> I guess I'll just have to go bet these gems on the camel races. Wait, you have gems? 
Let me see. Man, these rocks are so heavy, I can barely lift them. You want the gems? I want the outfit. Do we have a deal? Indeed. If you want to purchase these old rags, who am I to object? All sales final, no returns. <laughs> Great. So what's our power here? Fast climb? Okay. I understand now the special power wasn't quick climb it was the slow down time what oh here while wearing the seat outfit press the r2 button to activate your ability i got you i got you Just like although it seems we have another problem the lead tells me that miss decibel is constantly changing the locations of the captured thieves which makes them almost impossible to track. It's gonna be... Hold on, Sly. I'm picking something up. Sweet sunspot. Sly, the paradox is here. He's mating with Miss Decibel right now. She's gigantic, bro. <laughs> Sounds like the perfect opportunity for a little eavesdropping. Great idea. Just one thing. That outfit won't fool these guards. They know the locals and they'll peg you for a stranger immediately. You should just stay out of sight. Thanks for the info, Bentley. I'm on my way. I would grab that treasure, but I'm on a mission. Way to go, Sly. Now you better get going. Sly, don't let anyone see you. If the guards see you, it's over, Sly. Have I ever told you how exquisite your eyes are? They are like two perfect, shiny little stones. Oh, how sweet of you to say. I'm feeling a bit pettish. Must be time for a snack. If it is true that an elephant never forgets, then it is also true that you are an unforgettable elephant. <laughs> yeah. My, my, such a charmer. She has cruel the villa here. Also, in slide two, we were like riding elephants. What's the difference between those two elephants? Everything is progressing splendidly. I have those raggedy little thieves completely under my control. I've never seen better forgeries. The documents they're producing are of the highest quality. Perfect. Once I get them back to the present day and my royal lineage is discovered. My wealth and power will be unstoppable. Well, <laughs> there is one tense little problem. <laughs> we still need to feed our little worker bees, but our supplies are running low. The one who calls himself the panther seems to work best when I feed him scorpion claws. Disgusting! <laughs> yeah, very well. I shall have some delivered immediately. Whatever it takes to keep these vermin working. Oh, and one more thing. Tell your guards if they don't capture Hooper, I will have them all fired and then executed. Why, did you hear that? They're creating a false royal identity for Le Paradox in the present day. If that happens, he'll be close to untouchable. Must be all the camera. They also need a delivery. The panther needs scorpion claws. Maybe we can make that work for us. You should warn me before you do that. <laughs> this blasted sneezing is putting my trunk out of tune. Do be sneezing. <laughs> what, she got allergies or something? Trunk. You know, one might say you have a real nose for music. <laughs> uh -huh. <laughs> I must remember to bring a handkerchief next time. Ah, I 
can hardly wait until this business is completed, and I can, I mean, we can return to Paris for good. Uh, yeah, right. So, tell me, what do you think of this little sand pit? Well, darling, this dry environment plays absolute havoc with my sinuses. <laughs> my music practice has been atrocious lately. Would you like to hear that? Not really, but I want you to hear me. Do not fail me like those other idiots, Shelley. I'd hate to see you stranded here permanently. Oh, I, uh, I'll make sure that doesn't happen. Good, because the others have failed. Even Penelope, and she was the smart one. But now I have to turn my back on her. You understand? Oh, yes, of course. Everything will go precisely as planned. Uh, although, I must trouble you for some camel cheese. Absolutely horrid stuff, but the thief called the tiger seems to rely on it, and our reserves are almost depleted. Can't we just star these filthy hoodlums into submission? Ah, uh, fine. I will send a delivery boy. More delivery? Sly, are you thinking what I'm thinking? You know, in this life, you know. Camel cheese? Ew. 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 Perfect. And I just had my tail shampooed. The sooner <laughs> I get out of this sweat box, the better. So, any more requests? Oh, no, sweetums. I believe that's all. As soon as the documents are complete, I will deliver them personally. Magnifique! Then I should have them very soon. Oh, wait. There is one lost in the bitty little thing. <laughs> the one called the lion seems to favor cobra tails. And you know how troublesome those are to obtain. Fine, you shall have them. But I had better get those papers quickly. Boy, I'd hate to be the guy that has to collect the cobra tails. But I've got a crazy idea. That outfit may not work on the guards, but I bet outsiders like La Paradox and Miss Decibel would know the difference. She's expecting deliveries for the thieves, right? Try using the outfit to impersonate the delivery boy. If they buy it, we'll know where the thieves are being kept. Excellent idea, Bentley. And just to ensure it's foolproof, I'm gonna use my... No, Sly, don't say it! Italian accent! I said crazy, Sly, not suicidal. Okay. Oh, and this is... Okay, there was a couple other places on the map with these... Um... Where I was wondering how I'm supposed to do it so quickly. That all makes sense now. Also, didn't both of them go in this tent alone? Do I really want to do this? They're and who is this probably in there macking, bro. Squeak. Yes, identify yourself immediately. It's a me, uh, the delivery boy. You were called? Hmm, I don't recognize your scruffy features. The other boys are out to seek. Uh, something about the snake bites. Is there something wrong with your voice? No, uh, I've uh, talked like a this uh, my whole life. Uh. How droll. I see. Well, if you're really the delivery person, then you would know the usual orders, no? What a food does the panther require? Why the panther love the oh, scorpion? I thought we were gonna have to pick. Hmm. He appears to be legitimate. <sighs> Thank goodness. Here are the delivery locations. Hurry up, please. Very epic. Fly, it's a good thing we're in Arabia, because in Italy that accent would be considered a felony. Now let's go rescue those thieves. Bro, you didn't even drop linguini or macaroni one time. Of course no Italian's gonna believe you. He didn't drop one lasagna or fettuccine. Come on, man. Gotta use the essentials. Okay, we finally get to play with Thief Boy over here. Hmm, got a little bit of money. Silent Sprint. Oh, that's probably important. Let's go and buy that because that's kind of important. We're gonna run out of money buying it, but. S but. S Half the time I get caught because I get caught sprinting here. So, that's probably a good one to buy. 
Bum, bum, bum. So what's this homie special power? I guess they'll show us later, right? Yo, what up? Bop. You should wear my, more clothes. Oh, I have a paraglider built in. Oh, say less. You guys have seen me complain about every single Cooper thus far. Because no paraglider. They actually built one into them. What a wonderful sight. Look. That is beautiful. I couldn't ask for more. Thank you, game. Appreciate you and everything you do for me. Look at this. We flying. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Rugrats? That's hilarious. Okay, Selene. We know that Decibel has the Panther somewhere in that tower. Trying to go through the palace itself would be impossible. Luckily, this carpet shop is going to save us the trouble. Ah, yes. Honest Hassan's carpets. He owns many, many shops, but... He is not so honest, trust me. In fact, we used to run a flying carpet scam where he would pretend to be... Kind of pressed for time here. Fine. Please continue. So, according to my diagrams, the shop is connected to the tower. There's a vent system on the side of the building. All you have to do is crawl through the vents and it will lead you straight into the shop. From there, you can make your way through the shop's interior to the tower. <laughs> you make it sound so easy. I would like to see you crawl through vents when you are my age. Talk to you inside the shop. Good luck! How old is this Cooper? I mean, you could definitely tell he's older, but he can't be that old, right? Look at him jump. You can jump like that. You're fine. What's well, What is that in our hand? I'm guessing that's... Like, do they have arcane yet? Ruichi Cooper was both a ninja and a sushi chef. He invented I sushi. If this Bentley will have me jumping through hoops next. First, I grab the rope. Then I press the R2 button to climb up or down like lightning. Ooh, he can do it fast though. Okay, that didn't make any sense. Go fast, go fast. in the thieves handbook is expect the unexpected foresee the unforeseen predict the unpredictable keep your turban on my sonar reading show an old passageway through a cave system beneath the floor let's see massive payload angle of incidence relative humidity divided by two got it Elite. if we could drop that pallet of carpets in the corner it should slash a hole in the floor straight through to the caverns below we it seems that i will be doing all the work how about we just talk when you reach the passageway all right i was not listening to what they said the whole time so oh fit oh ah what do I do? What do I do? Don't mind me. Oh, that's. Why did it have to be snacks? I'm doing it wrong. Skirt. Okay. I don't know what I'm doing. But I'm figuring it out. Yeet. I would wish for this job to be over. Wow, those are some giant Diablo scorpions. Nasty. You probably just want to avoid them, but destroying those nesting mouths will clear them out. Keep moving forward and you should reach the base of the tower. Ew. Ew, dude. Get away from me. Oh, no. I just stuck my hand in... <laughs> All right. Booty. Can I bring you back some scorpions, Bentley? They taste just like chicken. No thanks. I'm trying to get back. 
That's it? That gave me like two coins. Why in the world? Okay. Why is there a whole treasure chest and you give me two coins out of it? Get that out of my face. Oh, do I gotta smack him multiple times? I got you, I got you. Whoops. Apparently I'm not supposed to go through those. Okay. Still, I still seem to have a little bit of trouble with this power here. As usual. Ah. Bruh, for real. Get out of my face. Get out of my face. I'm guessing the, the point is I'm supposed to destroy these nests, right? Yeah. Okay. I destroy the nests. I think that definitely the easiest way to do it is just to do this attack, because they can't really reach me in the meanwhile. Alright, here we go. Seriously? Stop. Oh, there's another one over there. Okay. Oh, I got you. I'm supposed to, like, actually manually crank this bad boy. Alright. Yeet. <laughs> he almost got me. Hmm. I would much rather be riding a camel with three humps. You gonna look away, bud? Three humps. A thousand thank yous once again for this most excellent idea. Why do you want to ride it with three humps? Hmm. What's what's so bad about two hump? I wonder if he's the same type of guy who only rides in luxury cars. Okay, I am much confusion. Okay. We did it. We did it. It's a collectible. But I got the collectible. Or did I get the collectible? Let's see. Is it? Did it let me keep it? It did. What? We got it, though. We got it. So, because we grabbed it, theoretically, we don't. We shouldn't have to grab it again, right? Nope. Okay. Alright, now that we got it, we don't have to worry about it anymore. Look at us go. Again, I, there was probably some, like, special strategy they wanted us to employ to do it, but, um... I don't, I don't like that. Am I supposed to go down here? Okay, maybe I am. Hmm. Haven't I already been here? Or is this... Am I going higher? Yeah. Give me a nap. I think it's nap time for me, bud. Zoink. I stick out that tongue for me. Yeah, shoot it up. Ooh. Oh, we not do that. All right, come on, Cobra boy, give me that tongue. You're almost there. Ooh. Hmm. 
was a climb and a half, not gonna lie. We got tank, Bentley and jeans, or tilty tilty. Tilty tilty. Okay, here we go. Let's see if they made this one ooh, any harder than usual. Not that strong, Bentley. Okay. Ooh, almost actually fell off right then. Ah. Okay, don't fall off, don't fall off, or you're bad. Am I, su am I supposed to? Okay. It don't, That usually looks like a death pit. So are you, are my, am I supposed to go into the death pit? Alright, an ancient emesis, clockwork. Yeah, we see. We tend to see. I wish they would, like, spice it up a little bit. I want to know some, like, secret information, man. I know all about clockwork. We just spent the past couple months playing all the games. My brother. Are you all right? Oh, oh, my head. Where am I? You have been imprisoned, hypnotized, and compelled to create forgeries by that evil elephant. But I have freed you from her mesmerizing music with, you know, some assistance. That's nice. I'm hungry. Did you bring me anything to eat? Perhaps some nice roasted scorpion tails? Maybe some camel milk? Amazing! I climb halfway to the stars to rescue you, and you expect camel milk? Why do I bother? Man wants his camel milk. Can you blame him? Well, yeah, I don't know. I'd be hungry too if I was being hypnotized. Keep an eye out for areas that can only be accessed with costumes. Yup. It's part of the reason why we don't have a bunch of the collectibles, because half of them I couldn't do for the longest period. Alright, Murray? Murray sounds about right. Let's grab him. Bum, bum, bum. And let's head over to his mission. Bah, 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 bah. You know what? Maybe we can um let's maybe try to get a treasure or two. I've actually got class in like ten minutes. I'm going to have to go. This episode's kind of running a little long anyway. So, you know what? Let's use the next, like, maybe 5-10 minutes. Let's see if we can get a treasure or two. And then we'll go ahead and add off the episode. But don't leave just yet. we got some treasure to find. Yes, I knew there was treasure right here. And there's also another treasure over there. But first things first. Ooh, they're giving us a full 70 seconds for this. That's more time than they usually give us. But this one's also kind of... Particularly far. What is the easiest way to get there? Oop, I'm stuck on a rock. I'm gonna assume just probably a straight shot there is probably the easiest. I'm gonna assume. Don't shoot. Ah! Please. Don't shoot, don't shoot, don't shoot, don't shoot! Ayo. Puffins, cookie jar, 191. Very cool. For the sake of my uh, my game crashing, we're going to go ahead and go in the hideout. My game really likes crashing. And the only way the only way I can like 100% save my progress is going inside the safe house. So All right, we grab this. Thank you. Now, can I fly straight there? 
I have a feeling we should be able to, right? Oh, yeah. Look at us go. Don't mind me. Also, I think I have the silent sprint now, so... That definitely helps. I also think that might have been the only way to get this in time, because we're... You know, we only had six seconds left over, so that was definitely it. Ooh, 309. That's a bit of cash. Is this a treasure? Oh, okay. Well, then we'll definitely take this one with us. I'm not gonna let it be lost so I can't find it again. Hello? Silent sprinting. Silent sprinting. Yeah, this one's not too bad. Give me a little bit of money for it. Golden magic lamp. Isn't this what uh the, the Sly's ancestor was looking for? A genie? Why don't we just give him that? There you go. You're welcome. Problem fixed. Alright, and the other treasure should be... Yes, right over here. Ooh, that's like a sword. Oh, we got another 70 seconds, so they gave us a lot of time for this one also. Don't shoot, don't shoot, don't shoot, don't shoot, don't shoot, don't shoot. Woo! For some reason, I thought that bird was shooting at us, and I don't know why. Excuse me. Oh, I was... I almost fell in the water right there. That was almost real bad. Alright. Hmm. What's the best way? Let's go ahead and not mess with that guy. Oh, yeah. Excuse me. Woo. That was almost close. Alright. Jeweled encrusted saber. Let's go ahead and run into the safe house. Let's make sure that we save that progress there.